Hello, hello y'all. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Vivian and if you're new, welcome to my channel. If you've been here uh, for a while now, you know that this is a different setting than I used to uh, use. Um, that has a couple of reasons. My regular, um, how do you call that, desk is at a pretty dark corner in my crafting room and um, it's pretty cloudy today so I didn't have the right lighting to do it on my desk this video and um, when it's cloudy I usually do unboxings on my floor in my craft room but I had to put a bed in my craft room because of my daughter just reasons just reasons you know nothing important nothing um, bad or just something like that either just because she's two and she has got an attitude but okay um for today i have something really exciting let me close my door first so for today i have something exciting because i got a new diamond painting order in today and it has a couple of new ones two brand new ones and one from like three or four weeks ago and for today we have Notre Dame Night. You can see it pretty well, so I think this is the perfect time to get this thing out of the plastic. But what I was talking about, so today I am at the desk in my parents-in-law their office. Or in our, yeah, just there. Um, words are hard to find today. Um, it's a square drill diamond painting. You move that because it has this blue strip up here and the square logo. Um, like I said, this is Notre Dame Night. It's a square diamond painting. And the picture is by David McLean. If I pronounce it right. It's a 98 by 70. So it's a huge one and guys it's so heavy is that everything no of course not that's everything so put the box to the side what we find in our box is our regular toolkits just a clear body with a funnel some baggies plates of heart shaped wax a multi placer with tweezers a pen and a grippy Nothing exciting. Then we have our picture. Let me show you. This is a gorgeous picture. Oh, I hear that my daughter's crying. Let me take a second and then I will be right back with you with this picture. Well, and then we find our little sticker which shows us the picture, the name of the artist and the name of the kit. It also shows us that this is a square and the size of the diamond painting, which is 98 centimeters by 70 centimeters, like I said before. This is a cute picture of Paris at night, and it's beautiful. Paris means a lot to me. It's been a huge part of my youth, or a huge part. I just loved it when I was a kid. And I've been there a couple of times. Um, also, of course, we have the canvas in a gorgeous dust sleeve, which says Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle. I always love that, but we're not here for the dust sleeve. We are here for what is in there. First, we put our diamond painting because it's so soft. And then I feel we have some drills in there. Oh, not just some drills. A lot 
whole lot, lot of thrills. What I see at first are purples and blues, greens, beautiful, and I already see some of these. We get into the drills in a moment. We also find our step-by-step -step instruction booklet, which we don't need because we know how to diamond paint. And we also, wow, find this sheet in there, which has a large picture of our diamond painting. Isn't it gorgeous, guys? Isn't it gorgeous? So many details. Come to that in just a sec. We have the name of the canvas and the artist, start and end date, so you can track yourself. And down below we have uh, the information about the kit. And here we have all our colors and symbols. Let's take a close look at it. And we see that our kit has 65 colors, guys. That's amazing. That is amazing. Well, I will roll my diamond painting backwards. So I will. Oh, wow. So, what's this? Probably for my table because it isn't the cleanest thing in my house. I roll it backwards, so my diamond painting will lay flat really quick, and I don't have to wait for it. I'm so, so, so excited. I'm sorry if you hear my daughter cry. Like I said, she's two and she has an attitude and she don't want to sleep. So I'll let her cry for just a second. But now we can take a look at this gorgeous diamond painting. And I'm so sorry for all the glare and stuff up here, which isn't mine. <sighs> so sorry about the glare, guys. Okay, let me move you for a sec. I'm sorry if this is annoying you, but like this, you can see everything much, much better. So, do you see it all? Y'all, it's beautiful. So many details. So, what we have, we have the Notre Dame, of course, a beautiful moon and a starry night. We have the Eiffel Tower, and some other buildings and what is it called again Montmartre I'm sorry if I pronounced it wrong but I guess it's that one we have a boat we where you can travel uh, with a bench up here and a doggy some birds, all gorgeous flowers all over the place. And um, yeah, just beautiful guys. The detailing in this picture is insane. I swear, it's insane. Wow. Also, if I see that it's not that much confetti as I expected it would be and that's a nice thing because I'm not that kind of confetti person so it's a person who just ordered a just pink wall I'm painting also excited for that but I see the sky is really much color blocking and the rest is also you can use your multiplacer a lot but not like only if you know what I mean, but it's beautiful. So let me take you back at your first side thing and then we take a closer look at all the drills. So I got all the drills out of their bag and as you could have seen, there are quite a lot of colors in this diamond painting and quite a lot of shades in every color. 
and that's something you can really really see when open up these bag of drills so don't waste any more time and let's get right into it to start right off with 796 we have another one and another one give me a sec and let me take off the lights because I forgot oh it's pretty dark up now okay next up is 3772 we have two bags of that we have 890 two bags we have 895 two bags 3371 looks like black is actually a really dark brown we have two bags of that we have 823 is a really dark navy blue 434 two bags of that 3853, 938, two bags, 905, 327, it doesn't show off the camera really right, but it's gorgeous purple, and 333. So that was the first pair of drills. Let's move on to our second, and that starts with Hello, with 210, a gorgeous pastel pink, 3607, 907, 3837, 742, 321, 814, 3770, 3777, 134 and that is our first AB. So AB stands for Aurora Borealis and I can't say that, I'm sorry. It is the iridescent coating that is put on the drills so they will sparkle brighter and catch more light than the others. So let's compare it to the regular drills. You see how these ones sparkle way more than these? And I think that it's gorgeous. We are going to see where these drills go in just a minute. For 98, 3826, we have another bag of that. 3064, another one. 666, 3860, 779, with two bags of that. And 3776. That was the second string of drills. Let's move on to the third. And that starts with two bags of 355. Oh, I'm sorry. 3830, 550. Another bag of that, a gorgeous dark purple. 820, 3854. Another one. 904, another one, 433, two of that, 340, oh wow, that's a gorgeous pastel purple, looks like bluish, but it's actually purple, 340, 939, 898, we have two bags of that, 155, two bags, 30, 746 and we have two bags of that. So what's the third strand of drills? Let's move on to our fourth and that starts with another AB. It's a new AB. It's 101. Please focus. Yeah, there it is. You see, it's beautiful. I guess this is my favorite AB. I believe this was in Marmalis in the CFT as well. I'm not entirely sure, but it's beautiful. Then we have 3864, 317, 3608, 135, another AB. You can see that pretty well because there are just some of them. 
Not so much though. Really curious where that will go. And we have another AB, which is 132. An orange one, beautiful. 37.99, 209, 413, 602, 600, 3340, 606, 414, 318, 995, 356, 720, 718, and 3024. Looks like mint green, but it's actually a grayish color. Okay, and then we have our fifth and last string of drills. That is 977. We have two bags of that. We have 310. Only one bag. That's fair enough. We have 333. Oh, that's the second bag. It was in another string too. Then we have two bags of 797 and 3855. So these were all the colors. Let's try to put these back in their bag and then we are going to see where the AB drills go and we take a closer look at the kits. So, so I got all the drills back in their bag and that w didn't went as bad as I thought it would. So I'm really happy with that. Um, so let's move them to the side. And welcome back at the glare video of the year. I'm so sorry y'all. I'm so sorry. Um, well, let's take a look at where the AB drills go. Let's see if I can zoom you a little bit more out. No, I can't. I'm sorry. Um, but with them in our club canvases, you have a legend on the right bottom and the left top. If I see, we see that our three, four ABs are the first ones on the legend. Our first one is the blue one, which is 101 and it has symbol one on the canvas. There weren't a lot of them. So I, yeah, I, I, I don't know, I'm sorry. If I see, I see some in the flowers just here but these are like only well maybe 15 drills I'd be sad if that's everything that yeah I guess that's everything that's sad because it's such a beautiful AB so so sad okay well let's move on I don't expect too much from the rest of the AB drills because our second is 132 and that was the yellow no I'm sorry the orange AB and it has number two and also just some here in these flowers over here also some in the flowers on the other side, just here. And let's see, I expected that they would light, sparkle up the, the Notre Dame and the Eiffel Tower itself even more. But it appears that that's not the case. And I don't see any more twos either. Maybe I'm missing something, but there weren't a lot of them, so it could be. Um, the next one is 134, and that was the green one. It has number three, and there were actually a lot of them. And I already see some. They're all down here in the bushes also here all the way in the bushes also in the green parts of the boat i don't know why also some up 
here in the light that's in the bush. Also a few to highlight this tree. Also here and there just to highlight all the green parts. And then we have our fourth, fourth and final AB which was the yellowish one. It is number 135 and it has symbol number 4. There weren't as much as well and I haven't seen a 4 yet. What color is again? More like a... Uh, like a greenish yellow or a yellowish green. Does that make any sense? Oh, also to high. I'm sorry. A hiccup. Also to highlight the tree, and that's it. So it's beautiful. And earlier this video, I started talking about what Paris meant to me, but I guess I saved that for a whip and chat because it's been a while. And I think this is one that I want to finish anytime soon. I don't know, because there are some awesome events coming. Um, well, I just lift the canvas so you can see what the symbols look like. And you can see some of the details. You can also see that's pretty dark in this room. So here we have the boat. You see the boat and you see the symbol clarity, like wow, wow, wow. What we have here is some flowers, beautiful. Let's see, I put the canvas back, you know, and I'm just going to move you because that's way easier. So. Here we have the bench and the dog. Cute little doggy. Bench. We have our. Uh, I'm pretty done with my camera. We have here our Notre Dame. I'm sorry if I pronounced it wrong in English, but you know, that's not something that I like every day. Here we have color blocking heaven and the moon and the Eiffel Tower. You see how beautiful this is. I'm so excited. I'm sorry for all my mess. So guys, what do you think? I'm really, really curious to know if you have this diamond painting in your stash or on your wish list. Because like I said, it's just a new one. So I'm really excited to do this and I'm really excited to know what you guys think about this canvas. Do you have it? Is it on your wish list? Is it coming? I'm really, really excited to know because guys. I'm so, so, so excited. I'm really excited to know what you think about this video and about this canvas. Please let me know down in the comments. I'd love to read all your comments. And um, yeah, guys, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. And then I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.